Hey you guys, it's Tawanda from A Blended Dream. Welcome back you guys. So, if you all know me, then you all then you all know that I'm just a piece of A Blended Dream. We have my amazing, beautiful wife, Alexis. Go check out her ch uh, personal channel, Sequoia's Journey. We have our oldest son that is a junior this year at college. Woo! We have another son that's a junior in high school. We have some, we're expanding our family. I'll just say that. So we have a lot going on. We have our five-year-old pug, Rocky Mountain, Rocky for short, and we have our two-year-old Yorkie, Stormy Monroe, but we call her Stormy. Thank you guys. If you're new, I wanna say welcome. I wanna tell you that everyone is welcome here. We love the Lord. We love the people. We love everyone. I don't want any negativity down in my comments. If there's something going on, you can discuss it, but discuss it, re discuss it respectfully. Everyone has the right to their opinion, but there will be no disrespect. No, no, no. You have a right to your opinion, but we're not going to be disrespectful. So if you all know me, if you've been here for a while, you all know I love all things that smell good. I love candles. I love lip gloss. I love smell goods. I like hauls. We do a lot of family things here and if you like a lot of family things but you want a little couple you know a little romance head on over to our couples channel tailored to you i know we haven't posted on there in a while but we're about to get that back started right so i am here today with another haul yeah i know i love y'all know i like bath and body works so bath and body works have been doing these Mm, uh, sales sporadically sales but not sales it could be a sale but it could be better but I guess you know due to the pandemic it's been crazy they try to make a little coin and I'm trying to spend a little coin because I love Bath and Body Works um go if you haven't seen my lip gloss haul on Bath and Body Works because I don't know if you missed that but hey they just had it, it was $2.95 that was the first time I saw that so I think I got like 12 or 13 I don't know something like that go check that video out so they just had a um, wallflower sale and you all know that when you order offline they usually Bath and Body Works usually puts a coupon in the box baby they haven't been doing that but we did get a coupon in the mail matter of fact it was my wife's coupon but her coupons is my coupon same coupons so um they had had a, a room spray sale and i'm not big on the rooms the room sprays and i knew that they were having a wallflower sale i didn't know how much the wallflower was going to be but i was saving my 20 percent coupon for it so boom they had to sell the wallflowers are 325 last year around november 9th 8th around that time i want to say that they had another wallflowers out. i know that they did because i did a video on it last year and i think the wallflowers was like a dollar 95 or 295 something like that i can't recall but and i know that they had to sell because i purchased like 20 or 30 at the same time even though it was a 20 limit um you know you can only get 20 at the time my wife was with me so she got 10 i got 20 bam that solved the problem but they did it for 325 i had a 20 percent coupon so that would bring them down to what like two dollars and 90 cents a piece so i went for it i only got 20 they didn't go with me that day but i did meet a new friend and waited outside the mall hi tamika i met a new friend oh my goodness listen we were talking about candles fragrances so i was really listen y'all know I mean, i'm a little you know we just were to ourselves so i was a little thirsty a little thirsty to get a little new I, I, well i don't know if she's calling me her friend because we just met do adults do that do we say that's my friend when you just met or you just be like oh i met somebody okay 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 i just met her like a couple days ago so i'm gonna say i'm praying that we have a friendship that's gonna blossom how about that? Do adults say that? Let me know down in the comments. Let me know down in the comments. But she had a, her energy was really positive. And we were just discussing like candles, smell good, things like that. And I really liked that. And she was positive and her energy was positive. So maybe a friendship that's going to blossom. Can I say that as an adult? Yeah, I know what I mean. So let's get on to this haul. So I originally I was not going to go because I just knew that the 
Bath and Body Works I go to, I knew that it was going to be wrapped around a corner and babe already saw it the day before and I was going to order offline. But let me tell y'all about me. I will buy, I will pay $100 for something and do not want to pay $5.99 for shipping. I don't know why. I'm just like that. And I was like, well, I'm going to order offline. But then I was like, if I order offline, that's like $5.99 for shipping and I could have got two more wallflowers for that. And I didn't want to go to... The Bath and Body Works that I usually go to, which is closest to us, because over there, they're only allowing 14 people in the store. The line is always wrapped around the corner, and I just didn't feel like that. So then I forgot that they we had another mall that no one really goes to. So I was like, let me go over there, and bam, I went over there. That's where I met Sneaker. And when we got in there, listen, it was no wait. I think there might have, might have been eight people, maybe ten, including the sales associates. And I was able to get in there. I didn't have to wait. Kind of mingle, look, didn't feel stressed out, you know, because I was taking too long and other people were outside of the store waiting. Because when you go to the one, that the Bath and Body Works that I usually go to, girl, people be in the window like this with their head against the, the glass, trying to see what you're doing in there. I can't, I don't feel comfortable with that because I feel like they watch me and I have to rush. Even though I could take my time, you know how it is. You know how it is standing in line. So I went there and your girl got wallflowers. I only got 20 because Gabe wasn't with me. And in all 20s, not even mine, my sister Nisha was calling me. But don't worry, she ain't getting none out of this batch. I just gave her some out of the ones I already had. Them son call. Them son call. Y'all know he's in college. And when we went and decorated his room and everything, I put a wallflower in his room. And I left him two wallflowers to do a refill. And he's he's living on campus. But it's like an um, apartment style dorm. So it's him, his roommate, and they share a bathroom. Then there's a big living area with a living room and a kitchen. I mean, it's nice. Then, on the, you know, then you just walk to the other side and there's two more bedrooms and a full bathroom. So it's like two full bathrooms. When I say full bathroom, shower and tub. I mean, it, and the bathroom is huge. So I didn't, I don't know why I didn't, but I didn't bring a wallflower for their bathroom. And so my son was like, can you give me a wallflower for our bathroom with the night lights? So I was like, yeah, I'll do it for you. So I got him. Let's start off with this. Um, this is really cute. It's navy blue and white, and I love it. And it was on sale. Its regular price was ten fifty. I got it for five ninety five on sale. And it's a night light, so I really like this. When I when we go pick them up this week, I'll have them put this in the bathroom. So let's get on with these wallflowers, honey. Now I went with some fall fragrances, but I also went with things I already knew that we liked. Cause who wanna? You could switch them out, but who felt like all of that? So um, around this time of year, they have flannel. If you all are new to Bath and Body Works with these wallflowers, if you want something strong, 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 you're gonna go with. I'm gonna tell you the ones to choose. Now we have two dogs, so we got kids running around, we got big boys running around, and when people come, they always say. I can't believe that you have two dogs in here and we used to have guinea pigs but they passed away but we had them for like six years so that's another story um we have wallflowers everywhere all through the house on top of that bleach come on now come on now but let's let's get started so i love flannel and this year what i am going to do is i don't know why i don't think about it but before fall is out i'm gonna go stock up on sweater weather and flannel so i can have them all year long so let's get started because those are fragrances they just carry during the winter and the fall and i like to have the flannel and i love to have flannel for the boys bathroom in their in their room so with flannel how many did i get hold on you guys boom all right i got two flannel so if you're looking for something strong, go with flannel. I got two flannel. Mm. Come on, give it to me. Give it to me, give it to me. I'm trying to see my face. It's flannel, you guys. I don't know why she acted out. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I got two flannel. We're not gonna waste too much time on that. And I gotta hurry up and do this for my sister Misha get here because 
but she might ask for some of the ones I don't want to share. So sweater, weather. Listen, that's a tongue twister. Sweater, weather. I know I picked up four of these. And I picked up four of these because I'm going to send one of these. Send two of these to my son's school for their bathroom. Sweater, weather is strong, but it smells amazing. It smells great on cold. And how I know this is because I have the candle. And I'm going to get a couple of these candles when they do the um, candle day. So sweater, weather, it's beautifully. I love the blue. It's like a royal blue. So I got sweater, weather. And like I said, I picked up four of those. Because two, two are going to my son's college for his bathroom. Him and his roommate. Um, it, I picked up two eucalyptus mint. I like these. No, there's, okay. The flannel and the sweater weather will rotate between the boys' room and their bathroom home. I already said I'm sending two to my son's school for their bathroom. Um, the eucalyptus mint, sometimes sometimes I will put this in a boy's room. It just depends. But a lot of times I'll put this in um, the wallflower that's next to our trash can in our kitchen. So, but it's power. It's strong as well. I'm sorry, you guys. So I got two eucalyptus mint. That's, a, that's kind of a pretty green. It's almost like the August birthstone. I have, um, I picked up one winter. I picked up one winter. Everyone in the store was talking about it. So I just picked it up. I'm not sure what it smells like. Once I, and they didn't have a candle for it. So once I smell it on cold, I may, I'll, I'll, just, I'll determine it. If I really don't like it, I may just throw it in the laundry room. I don't know if, it, if it's not like a favorite scent. So that's winter. Tell me if you all use that. Fresh, um, fresh fall morning. I only picked up one of these because it's a new, it's not new to Bath and Body Works, but it's new to me. So I didn't want to get a lot of things that I wasn't sure about. So I'm going to try that one too. Um... A Thousand Wishes. I picked up two of these. I love A Thousand Wishes. The fragrance for myself, I use it. I usually put these in our my bedroom and my bathroom. Yeah. This stress relief, it depends on how my wife is feeling. Sometimes she'll ask me to put them in our bedroom. We have a couple of these left, so I only picked up one. So yeah, stress relief. Sometimes she'll ask me to put them in the bathroom. So if she asks, I'll just put that for the month or however long it lasts in our bathroom. Um, Gingham. I only got one of that. That is my wife's signature fragrance. She loves it. So I have a double um, wallflower in my bedroom. Now it's double. They don't diffuse at the same time. I think it stays on one because the night light shines it for five days and then it switches over to the next one. So I might put this in a stress relief one in our bedroom. I'm not sure. I just switched them over before I went to the cell. So it'd be a while before I put any more up. They last about... I want to say they last about six weeks or seven weeks or something like that. Japanese cherry blossom I usually put in my living room I also have a double heat I have double warmers just about everywhere through the house um because sometimes when you're using these things you become what they say nose blind like I don't know I can't smell them and that's because I'm in a house with it all the time but when my sisters or people come like my sister's like I can't believe I can smell your house as soon as I get out my car and, and that's because we probably got I got wallflowers all through the house and I have candles, but I don't burn candles every day. It just depends how I'm feeling, but my wallflowers are always in and you know, when you are in it all the time, you can't smell it um, because I, I live in it all the time, but my everyone always says how good the house smells. Um, they always want to know what we're using, different things like this. So this Japanese cherry blossom is pretty strong. That usually goes in the living room. And I also have a double wallflower. And all the uh, wallflowers that we have have night lights on them. 
every last one of them. The ones in the kitchen, they all have a night light. We got the ones with the night light. I did Harvest Gathering. I wanted to try this out. And I don't know if I'm going to like it, but I wanted to try some new fall ones out. My sister's hoping that I don't like it because she'll be like, if you don't like it, no need to bring it back. Let me get it. And I'll give it to her. Cozy Cashmere. My wife really loved the um, candle. And when I go to Candlelit this year, I'll probably get like four of them. I'm not sure. Maybe more. And so I wanted to pick one of these up because I know that she loved the candle. And I want to be considerate. Like my wife does not like anything that's... Um, cinnamon stuff like that now she knows that i love pumpkin all things and she's not she's not the biggest fan but she'll be like babe you go ahead and put one in but i won't put it in the room because to me that's just selfish even though i know you know she tells me it's okay i might put it like in the kitchen or somewhere like that where it's just not like just always on her um so that's that in the stars is a good strong one for your bathroom like stuff like that it's powerful it's powerful And if they do another song in November, I'm going back and my baby's going with me because I'm getting 40. Or I might go back twice and get 60. Just let it be what it is. Um, I got Marshmallow Fireside. I've never had it in a plug-in. I've always, um, last, last candle day, I think I purchased two. No, or maybe it was in the fall. I can't remember. And I love the Marshmallow Fireside. I didn't think that I would, but I loved it. But I wasn't sure. And then Tamika was telling me that she loved it and it smelled really, really good. So I just picked up one because I wasn't that sure about it. Um, if I'm not, don't like it, like it, I'll probably put it in the guest bathroom. Because not that it stinks, but sometimes things are just not always your favorite. So, this is um, Marshmallow Fireside. If I like it, then when I go back out, I'll pick up some more. And some people say that they use these wall plugins for different, um, you know, spring wants to spring. But not me. I use whatever I want to use whenever I want to use it. If I want to put in a Christmas one in dead heat, middle summer, I'll do it. I'm, it's just on what I like and what I want. Now, uh, my last one is Laundry Day. I don't know why I didn't pick up more of these. I love them. Laundry Day smells just like it says. Laundry Day, sometimes I'll stick this in a laundry room. It just depends. Sometimes I stick it in the kitchen. It doesn't matter um as long as it smells good come on come on there just a little bit she a little shy so that's laundry day so that is it um that is it for my haul let me tell you how much i saved um whoa okay so I had a total discount of $111.24. I ended up paying $61.30 and that was after taxes and all of that stuff. And I would have paid less if I didn't get my son's plug in. And I had 22 items. Yeah, 22 items. So that is that. So tell me you guys, tell me if you went, if you're big into the um, plugins, if you use something else, I want to know. I'm, I'm willing to try different things. Tell me if you made the sale. Tell me if there's another sale and you're planning to, if, and you're planning to go to another one, but I'm planning to hit them all. I'm going to be honest. This time when they have another sale for the plugins, because we have so many around the house, I need to do more than 20. So what I'm probably going to have to do is bring babe with me. We get 20 a piece and then walk out the store and walk back in and get another 20 so that I can just have them or maybe I'll pick some up during a semi-annual sale but our sales we're so busy here in Columbia like everything is always taken like some of these smaller towns people be like oh they had this this and that and I got 30 of these I'm like we didn't even have 75% off table so that's that so thank you guys again for coming by stopping by to join us don't forget to like hit that thumbs up button don't forget to tell me where you like to go tell me what you use that's commenting down there don't forget to spread the word share our channel and once again don't forget to hit that red button boom that's subscribing thank you guys again for stopping by talk to you guys later bye